Hi guys, my name is Blake Francis. I'm taking a macroeconomics course and I'm going to show you guys all about exchange rates, the law of one price, and the principle of arbitrage today. So as you can see here in this, in this table right here, we have the exchange rate table. So this table is basically saying that one Great British pound sterling is worth 1.26 of a US dollar. And as you can see, every day, every hour, every second, these rates are constantly changing. So tomorrow, this rate could be 1.27, it could be 1.2, it just depends on the day and depends on the economy as well. Also, you can also reverse this. So 1.26 US dollar is worth one sterling, one sterling is worth, worth 1.26 US dollar. So let's talk about the principle of arbitrage right here. So we're gonna talk about the Big Mac. So the Big Mac is going to be our product. These numbers are just examples, they're not actually real life numbers. So let's say for instance that the Big Mac is worth two Great British pounds. So I go to a McDonald's in Great Britain and I buy a Big Mac, I can buy it for two Great British pounds. So two Great British pounds is worth $2.52. So here in the United States, a Big Mac sells for five US dollars. So what? exactly is the principle of arbitrage here so arbitrage is we're going to buy low and then we're going to sell high we're going to buy here and we're going to sell there for example we're going to buy the great british we're, i'm sorry we're going to buy the big mac in great britain for 252 and then we're going to try to sell it to the people in the united states because the people in the united states are buying it for five dollars so we can buy it in great britain for two two Great Britain pounds, which is equal to $2.52. And then we're gonna to try to sell it in the United States because in the United States you can buy for $5. So for example, the principle of arbitrage, the principle, the law of one price. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna buy it low, buy it in Great Britain low, and we're gonna sell it for a higher price to make a profit off it in the United States. So arbitrages are trying to push the price equal. So if we're selling it at two, we're buying at two fifty-two, and the United States is buying it at five dollars. They're gonna try to make it in between. They're trying to crunch the price to one price, and that's the law of one price, basically. So maybe, for example, that we would be selling it for around maybe four ten in the United States with this law of one price. So let's bring this to a graph here. So this graph right here is the economy the exchange rate economy of great britain so for example when we're buying more big macs because the price is lower there the demand curve is going to shift outward that is going to also increase the price and as we look here the supply curve is also going to increase it's going to shift outward and that is going to lower the price of the euro which is effectively the law of one price and effective effectively the the principle of arbitrage here well guys thank you for watching my video i hope that helped a little bit hope that i can i was able to explain things a little bit better for you guys